The year of the London Olympics was a very significant occasion for London, so we decided to invite Herzog de Murren and Ai Weiwei to collaborate again for the first time since they had designed the bird's nest in Beijing for the Beijing Olympics, because we felt that kind of link, Olympic link, was really, really timely. What they did was a kind of homage and certainly a reference to all the other pavilions that had been designed for that site. It became a kind of excavation where they dug down into the garden, but it was also something where you had this great dish on top, which is where the ducks came to swim. So this sort of higher level and the lower level, it was like the jam in the sandwich sort of pressed between the two. It was made of cork and the smell was very, very evocative. And that soft material that, as you walked on it, was a very, very particular sensation. It felt kind of loamy, that wonderful English word, that even though it was the height of summer, there was a kind of coolness and a tranquility and a darkness and a calmness and a kind of almost dampness that was really very particular to this project. There isn't a need now, and there wasn't a need then, for the British public to see the work of Herzog de Murren because, of course, it's very well represented by Tate Modern. But what we were doing was to present to the British public a collaboration that was so successful in Beijing. We Skyped with Ai Weiwei, who still is unable to leave China. And we felt that it was important on this particular occasion to explore this partnership, which has been such an incredible success.